Alright, what's going on dudes, and welcome back to some more Minecraft Pocket Edition 0.15.0 update news video. And this week recently, the developers have been going crazy, giving us tons of update news, and today is going to be more of that. So why don't we go ahead and get started. So all of the tweets today come from Jason Major. He's been an awesome developer who's been giving us so many hints of what features are to come, so make sure you do go ahead and follow him. So why don't we go ahead and get started. So Jason Major tweets out, instead of sending bananas to Tommaso Chechi, how about some horses? So as you can see in the screenshot on screen right now, he shows two different types of horses. He shows a brown one, and then he shows a whitish one. And he also shows the bar at the bottom. Now if you don't know what the bar at the bottom means, that basically means their jumping strength, or how high they can jump. So as you can see, there are two orange bars, meaning that horse can jump two blocks. So depending on like how far the orange bar goes, that's how many blocks the horse can jump, which is pretty awesome. So I know courses were already confirmed a long time ago, but this just shows some in-game gameplay of it, which is pretty awesome. He's never showed like horses, just horses, like he's showed other stuff with it, but he's never just showed horses and nothing else, which is pretty cool. So yeah. Anyway, why don't we go ahead and move on to the next tweet from Jason Major again, and he tweets out, here's something new that you'll see in Minecraft PE 0.15, craftable leather horse armor. So, uh, as you can see in the following screenshot, there is a crafting recipe, so we don't really need this because we don't have PC crafting, but it just shows you like how much leather you're gonna need for it, and you get one per crafting. So, so yeah, that's pretty cool. And then in the second screenshot, he shows you how the uh, horse armor is put on. So yeah, it's just a little protection for the horse so that it doesn't take as much damage. Like when you're doing defensive stuff, like if you're PvPing with horses or someone accidentally hits your horse, it can protect your horse from doing a little more damage. Just like when you wear armor in a Minecraft PE or in Minecraft in general, you take less damage. So basically that's the same way that it works for the horse. So a lot of horse stuff to get here. Well, Jason Major also tweeted out, Hitting 100k followers has put me in a generous mood. Last feature reveal before beta releases. So as you can see, there's like purple water in the cauldron. Now you may be like, why is he holding the uh, armor and the uh, cauldron? Well, as you can see in the next screenshot, you are able to dye horse armor. So you're able to make it different types of colors using the cauldron, which is super awesome. And then in the third screenshot, you can see the horse with the purple armor. And he looks pretty swagalicious in it. So yeah, it's just, you know, to differentiate your different horses. So like, if you don't want to name your horses, this could be another way to tell the difference between your horses is by uh, dyeing their armor. So yeah, this is a pretty nifty feature. I don't know if it's been in PC or not, but if it isn't, then this could be an exclusive feature. So yeah, lots of horse stuff today. Uh, maybe we could go for like 10 likes if you're excited for horses in 0.15. Also, let me know in the comment section when you think 0.15.0 will come out. I think it will come out probably either today or tomorrow. You let me know in the comments. So yeah, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you all next time.